We had to stop you because we're, hello, it's welcome to the view. We are <laughs> making huge announcement today. We're kicking something special off. We are happy to announce yes. that Raven Simone is now permanently <laughs> for the Cheetah Girls. Right. Didn't come back for the next Cheetah Girls. Came right. back again. Came with you and Broadway. Yes. And I'm very happy to be sitting with these smart, talented mentors. And I brought you gifts. Ah. <sighs> Let's see. Oh, my. Oh, sneaky. Oh, Nicole, you get chocolate? Hi. Thank you. She loves chocolate. I don't like normal presents. I like presents that you would normally not yes. think. Yes, yes. Um, I heard that you love bacon. I don't work here, and I get a gift. This is even better. <laughs> Thank you. You gotta start somewhere. Right? I'll start right here. Tres leches? Tres leches, my Tres favorite! Oh, yeah! Oh, 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 oh. Yes! And potato chips and watermelon. Thank you. <laughs> you know. You get this? You need, you need a fork? Mm -mm. No, of course not. <laughs> um, you guys, let's have some fun. All right. Yes. You ready? All right, because there's another person celebrating right now, and that is LeBron James, who scored 40 points last night to lead the Cavs to game three victory over the Warriors. <laughs> Did you guys watch? I watched. I, I, I watched at the theater. Mm -hmm. I watched in the car, mm -hmm. coming from the theater, to the after party for Jason Alexander, who blew it out. Congratulations, Jason right, Alexander. Right, right, right. Um, and I was riveted. I was, I, you know, uh, Golden State came back from a 20-point deficit. Mm -hmm. I thought they were going to nail it. And LeBron James not only used his muscles, but he used his court intelligence. Mm -hmm. He used his basketball intelligence. Mm -hmm. And he just, I mean, he just... He was really incredible. I was going to say, it, it, it felt to me like he decided he was going to win. Like, it oh. really did feel mental. And, yeah, I'm from the Bay Area. <clears throat> if Golden State wins, I'll be happy. But I love you, LeBron. When you're that good, is it, even, <laughs> is it even an effort? It looked like he was just doing layup practice. I mean, this is what I did for the game. Because, you know, I don't watch the game. But we did create a meme for it. So I want to put that up really fast. Did you <laughs> think I wasn't going to lose, Corey? Did you think oh! I was going to lose? Just so you know, but I don't watch the game. I only use the memes from different basketball players because they give the greatest face. Yes, that came from when he did a play that he just used his mm -hmm. court intelligence and he turned to Curry and he went, and I was like, wow, yeah. wow. Well, and you know, it ain't over till it's over. That's <laughs> right. So there are more games to be played and we shall see. And we shall see. And we want to get uh, into the latest on the maximum security prison break in New York. The investigation continues into whether or not the pr uh, prison worker played any part in their escape. Her son, however, was quick to speak out defending her. Take a look. When you're put in a situation where a family member is threatened or other family members might be, you know, threatened or at risk, you do a lot of things that you wouldn't think to just protect your family. And in my family, family always comes first. Well, you know, I, I, again, it's, this story is not going anywhere. It's kind of crazy. It's going to go on and on and on, but, you know. They've been lost. They've been gone for four days. They say this is the longest. Normally, they're really fast with catching people, right? Well, if they, know, you know, they always say the first 48. The police. The, the first, first 48. 48. Right, that's a TV show. <laughs> they, yes, <laughs> but they were gone. You know, yeah. they were gone in the first 48, yeah. and God only knows where they went. I hope they are up in the wilderness somewhere. Well, they said they They're were right south. behind us, actually. Well, it, oh. <laughs> it's, it's... <laughs> I get it. First day, I get it. <laughs> this, is the one, this is the woman that helped them break out of prison, right? Well, no, 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 no. no, no. This is another allegedly. one. Allegedly. No. Allegedly. No, no, no. Yeah. Right. Yeah. I think you right. have to remember that 
The, the people they're looking for are hardened criminals. They were convicted of. No one is saying that they they are innocent. She is innocent of, of everything. She's being Until investigated. Uh, She's sure, being questioned for uh, maybe providing them with the tools. But we with you know, power that, tools, right? How else would they have gotten <laughs> power tools in? I mean, that's that's a lot of muscle control. Because that's apparently a lot of they <laughs> are apparently they are uh, on good behavior. And that allows them to have access to power, to power tools. tools. Right. So, okay. Which yeah. is just mind-boggling when you right. think about it. Because if well, I had... Well, you dismembered uh, somebody. Because oh, I, yeah. I go straight to power tool yeah. for that, right? And also, you know, know. Yeah, let's give them you kind of to think tools. it's kind of freaky. But, okay. Didn't she have a... a, a, a she had an anxiety had a attack? She, had, she, she, ha, she, she said that she had an anxiety attack, so she a told the police attack. that she was trying... Yeah, she had a panic attack. She was going to help them, but then she turned herself and Not turned herself in. She admitted she had a panic attack. This she wasn't going to help them. Yeah, this is all speculation. speculation. In but show until show. we... Yeah, oh but, you know... Yeah, welcome. There, there's all kinds of <laughs> stuff yeah, really out good. there. That's but... but sorry. Sorry. That's okay. Three milks. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so you already did it, but you're going to do it again. Yes, I will, yes, I will do it again. I would like to welcome a new cast member to our play, Larry David's Fish in the Dark, last night. Jason Alexander took the stage for the first time and turned it out. Turned it out. He was stupendous. We thought that he was going to have the, you know, first night jitters. Nothing. This no. man is a pro. Yeah, I mean, he it. had us laughing. It, it's hard for me to yeah. break face. Yeah. And I'm telling Tell you. Tell what that means. Start. Uh, it means that you, you break your character and you and the other Crack person, uh, right. you start laughing. Right. And he had me, he had me yeah, on the edge. He's close. so good. He's so good. It's, it's a wonderful show. Larry David ran backstage uh, during intermission. And he was like, I'm a clump. And so, uh, yeah, he was very happy. Congratulations, well, Jason. You know what else is making people for clumped? <laughs> Zoe Saldana's husband decided to take her name when they got married. <laughs> and apparently, for some reason, people lost their minds about this. I, why do y'all care? I don't know. But people were very freaked out. They were saying, you know, you know, men will get all messed up if they do. They won't be men. And what the hell? Why does, what's wrong with him taking her name? I, think, I don't know why it matters. I don't know why it matters. I don't know why, it care, uh, why anybody cares. I don't know why we insist on poking our nose in people's bedrooms. I think that's creepy. I think that if he wants to take it, first of all, she makes more money. So good for her. Does she gets she? to wear the pants. We know that? Yeah, I'm pretty sure she makes more money. Well, I mean, he's an artist. He's an artist, and he could sell more paintings than she actually might get jobs throughout the year, so it could pan out evenly. I think it's awesome that he took her name because it just shows that he's not power hungry in a man sense. Like, sure. you have my name, I'm also the head of the household. They could be more of a progressive relationship to where everybody can share things. I mean, his name might sound better with Saldana, or she's like, listen, if I change my name, my my brand might change. Like, who knows? Brand. And I, speaking as someone with an incredibly difficult last name, I understand maybe his is a weird last name. I'm looking to get rid of Schlesinger any way I can. <laughs> any wife that wants to marry me, give it away. I know Zoe. Mm -hmm. She's a very lovely girl. Mm -hmm. She's a very 21st century girl mm -hmm. and very forward thinking. And her husband is just a wonderful man and, 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 is, and, and is all about empowering women and empowering just human beings. And I think that he probably took it just on that alone. Yeah. It's nothing to do with the fact if he makes less or more well, money. Well, was a joke. And, <laughs> yeah, but I'm just saying that, that, I'm just saying, it, it has nothing, a lot of people, you're joking about it, but a lot of people are making that statement yeah. and it's not a fair statement. Yeah. He's a very I, progressive man. I think man. before yeah. we, I mean, feminists, we all want equal footing, but wouldn't it be nice to have just like a leg up for a little bit before we get equal footing? Wouldn't that well, be nice? Well, I, I have to tell you, you know, I, Everybody says they're feminists and feminists. Maybe he just saw it as something he wanted to do. Maybe he yeah. just thought it was a good idea. Yeah. Nothing to do with feminism and empowerment. Maybe he just said, hey, I, I like that. Yeah. And call me crazy. But we're going to go and come right back with more potato chips and food and more hot dogs.